Look at this, now I can finally control my lights with the stream there. LensVid's coverage of IBC 2024 is brought to you by Small Rig, Small Rig, Big Dreams, and Hollyland, made to inspire. Hi, we're at IBC 2024 and we're at the Enron booth and we're talking to Justin. Hello. Hi. And uh, you have a new software which uh, should work with all of your lights. So maybe take us through what it can do. Definitely. So um, this is a new Amaran desktop app. Uh, which can, well, as, as you were said, it controls all your lights. So um, you can have all the lights over here, but you can also make groups. Um, and, I mean, and from here you can uh, adjust all your lights at the same time, uh, which is really nice. Um, but also individually, uh, you can... Um, you have setups uh, basically for 32, 4,000 and 5,600 yeah. Kelvin, but... Yeah, also, medium. exactly. So it can, um, yeah, you can just uh, have the slider over here. You also have green magenta shift as well. Uh, control your HSI. You can also make shortcuts too. So let's say, use yeah, so let's say you have, uh, you like uh, how your lights are positioned, like the, the, the effects or the color it has make a shortcut and you can come back to it at any time. Yeah, that's fantastic. If you have like five lights, you're not going to remember how you set that up. Exactly. You don't have to write it down or something. Exactly. exactly. So that's, yeah. And you can make as many as you like. You can make as many as you want. Yes. That's fantastic. Yeah. Here you can also control. Yeah, these are a little like uh, preset colors. So let's say you like uh, have a bonfire light emitting or have a blue sky or uh, like a desert. It all just, it'll just have them. Yeah. This is for the lights or just for the interface? This is for the lights. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You want you want to have it on this light over here? Yeah. Let's let's see how let's have an, a live demo. Definitely. Here you go. So here you can have a blue sky or more like a forest light emitting or um, a lavender light. <laughs> Anything you want really. But uh, over here you can adjust it just how you like. By the way, how does it work from a desktop computer to the lights? I mean it. Bluetooth. Bluetooth? Bluetooth. So basically yeah. a computer does have to have Bluetooth. So if you have an yeah. old desktop computer that doesn't have one, it won't work. No, exactly. But you can have a Bluetooth adapter. Oh. Also really cheap. It works uh, like that as well. Yes. Um, and from the desktop, you can also um, select um, all the effects. All the effects. So let's say you have a pulsing light, select a color from here, click confirm. It'll change that immediately. Yeah. And we also side you have live view, which is interesting. You told me about this yes. before. Yes. So live view is if you have um have a camera connected to your desktop, um, you don't have to have any other software or website open. Um, you can have your the live view of your camera in the same um, uh, software where you can like um, adjust your lights. So if you're doing like a live and you have some Amaran lights, you can control them from here and see the effect of the image. On, the, on the same yeah, page. That, that, yes. That's very, very convenient because if you have to switch between... Yeah, you don't have to switch, exactly. Uh, this exactly. is very convenient. Okay. Exactly. And I see something about presets on the side. What's that? Presets, yes. So this is... um. So let's say you have a uh, like an effect which you really like. Um, let's say you like the um, uh, the cop car effect. Okay. And you adjusted a little bit of the cop car effect. Let me just turn them. And, and you can save it as a save it as a preset. It'll go over here. Uh, it'll go here. So and now it is saved, and you can come back to it all. Exactly. You see, kind of has the shortcuts. Yeah. But for the effects. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is this is very useful. The, the idea, I think, the way I see it as useful is that this can actually remember every setting that you have, especially if you have a lot of lights and you, there are like you have a studio where like this lights controls this scene and this lights control this scene. You can have all of them very easily on your computer and you know use them very quickly and and yeah star of the show. For me as a as a Stream Deck user, this is a <laughs> maybe the most important thing, the integration into Stream Deck. Yeah, so this is the Elgato one. Um, we made um like a um how do you say that? Basically, I'm, you can have shortcuts on the stream deck for basically everything that you have near. Yes, exactly. So, you know how it works. Yeah. So I can drop the thing on this on the in the software. Can give it a title, give it a background. Um, and yeah, 
this this to it. This is what's a, a, an app that uh, you created all for the Stream Deck, right? No, we have a um, how do you say that? Like an um, you you edit basic. It's it's not a plugin. A plugin. Yes, that's the word I was looking for. Uh, so it's a plugin for the Elgato app. Um, place it in the software. And from there, you can well adjust the knobs, press the buttons, and of course, does it work? Ah, before it worked. It worked before. <laughs> It's worth for the demo. Oh, no, no, wait. Yeah. You ch we changed something. We changed a few things. Let me just do that. Here we go. Turn now, and now if you turn it on. Turn it back on. It exactly. exactly. Fantastic. So this is really cool. This is available right now. You can download it if you have Amber and Lights and for free. Play with it and for free. Exactly. Yeah. And it does work, I think, also with Aperture. I think it's it works with Aperture Lights as well. Yeah, definitely. So it doesn't replace anything. Yeah. Um, Aperture uh, lights work on the desktop app as well. We also have a new mobile app too. Uh, our Aperture lights work on that as well, but it doesn't replace the Cytus Link. Yeah. It's it, alongside. It's alongside the Exactly. Side. Yes. Okay. Fantastic. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. And uh, for all of you, don't forget to subscribe to LensVid. Check out more videos from IBC on LensVid. And we'll see you in the next video.